Eli Maskey, and I work on the New Internationalism Project. Aya Folk, Communications Team. Ebony Slaughter Johnson, Criminalization of Poverty Project. George, Climate Policy Project. Louisa, Peace Economy Transitions Project. Brandon, and the New Economy Maryland Project. Hi there, Development Team. Otto Tang, Global Economy. I'm in the Next Leaders Program. Next Leaders Program. Next Leaders Program. Next Leaders Program. I've served as uh, Phyllis's research assistant, editor editorial assistant. Um, I've done some fact-checking work, and I contribute my own writing. This summer, I worked on a report on the school-to-prison pipeline. I'm working with David Hart to create an economy in the state of Maryland that is more equitable and sustainable for all. I worked on written content for the new website that's going to be launching later this year. This summer, I worked to educate myself and others um, on climate change and climate justice. I would say for me, one of the most um, rewarding and wonderful pieces of the Next Leaders program was getting to know the cohort. My favorite part of the Next Leaders program has been um, the various workshops that we've had with local and national kinds of organizations. Uh, it's been really interesting for me to see the connection between policy and organizing work. We have people here who are doing incredible uh, works of literature, who are doing incredible work in, this, in society, and we get to be among that. But it's also a very relaxed thing. It's not, what time did you come in today? It's, what are you doing today for other people? And I think that's absolutely incredible. Take risks and, and put yourself out there and go ahead and make mistakes. Make friends with the other interns like right off the bat because you know they're there they're right next to you every day for 10 weeks and they're wonderful people. Ask all the questions all the time to everyone. Um, because I'm I'm a big proponent of the idea that the answers that you may seek are never really too far away from you. Um, and I think that, that holds especially true here in a creative space like IPS. Be open to what the internship could look like. Um, even if you have an idea of what the summer is going to turn out to be, you're going to be attending so many different workshops and learning about so many new things that that could end up changing over time and having that open-mindedness um, could suit you during the summer. Everybody's here because they have an interest in something, they have a passion in something, and they're willing to help you. They want to see creativity, they want to see curiosity, so why not go up to these people? Go to that happy hour or go to that event at Bus Boys and Poets. I want to engage with social justice advocacy work uh, in some capacity in my career. I feel that I'm now better at making connections between issues and also better equipped to work in coalition. I have now found my true passion. This is something that I truly want to do for the rest of my life and IPS has helped me understand that. Well, I'm leaving with not just a set of professional skills that I know are going to help me in, in the workforce in the future, but also just a greater understanding and appreciation for what needs to be done in this world and what we want this world to look like during our time in it. Enriching. Transformative. Enthralling. Growing. Inspiring. Potential. Divergent. Propelling. 